Hey guys, it's Nick, and today I'm going to show you how to use Eruda on Safari to access developer features that are usually found on desktop browsers. Eruda is a script that gives us a very feature-filled developer tools experience from right inside Safari. Features like Inspect Element, JS Console, CSS Inspector, a Resources tab, Browser Features Detection, and more. We can enable Eruda with either an iPhone shortcut or by adding the script as a bookmark. This shortcut is courtesy of Reddit user NDH4K4. I'll have a link to the shortcut in the description. To install the shortcut, you might have to turn on a setting to accept shortcuts from the internet, which can be found in Settings, Shortcuts, Allow Untrusted Shortcuts. Once that is accepted, download the, the shortcut. After your shortcut is installed, Go back into Safari and open a website. From there, you can click the share. Inside of our share options, we scroll down until we find console. And from there, we have Eruda running in the bottom right. The next method is to add the script as a bookmark inside of Safari. To do this, we'll go to a random page such as Apple and we're going to add this site as a bookmark. You can just leave it as the default settings and save it. Once you have the bookmark saved, follow the link in the description that will take you to the GitHub page containing the script. We're going to copy the whole script. Copy. And then go back into your bookmarks. Click edit on the one you just made. You're going to change it to something like console or Eruda. You're going to change the URL. And you're going to paste the script you just copied from the GitHub page and click done. And then we can go back to our Apple page. The bookmarks, Eruda, and we have it in the bottom right there. This will also work on any other page as well. Let's look at a few of the features that Eruda contains and how we can utilize them. First off is the Elements tab. Here we have a lot of attributes, HTML, style sheets, and in the bottom left we even have an Inspect Element button. So we can scroll down in our page and select, for instance, this A tag and see the styles as well as computed styles and attributes that are contained on this A tag. Next, if we go to the Resources tab, as you can see, we have local storage, we have session storage, cookies, things like this, as well as script links and style sheet links, including images that are requested. In the sources tab, we have the entire page source in HTML. In the info tab, we have the location, the user agent, device, system, other things about the browser that we're using. Go into snippets. We have lots of little snippets to cover here. We have a border all, which will add border to all elements. The timing plugin allows us to view the resource waterfall and how long it took for everything to load on the page. The DOM plugin allows us to navigate the DOM tree. Touches plugin allows us to visualize our touches on the screen. The features plugin allows us to view what features we're using and have available on our browser. You can click any of these and it will take you to the Can I Use page. Another cool feature is that we can change the theme for our entire Eruda console. Go over to settings and then theme and pick any one of these we want. For example, Material Pale Night. This will change the theme for all of our elements and extensions. While this might not be able to compete with an actual DevTools experience, it can be useful for inspecting a website on the go. Thank you for watching.